Hey everybody, it's best friend Kate, and I am on my morning walk, and I just, since it's spring here now, I guess it's been spring, but you know what I mean, um, nothing starts blooming until mid-March here, but I'm noticing that there's like a lot of diversity on my walking path, and I'm like in a city, so I'm going to show you guys what I'm seeing. Let me turn this camera around. Okay, so like, I'm just standing here, we got like some sort of spruce or fir tree, and there's cedars and this is hawthorn i think very lovely hi guys got a snowberry bush growing right here i don't know what that is uh let's see here got dandelions of course that's always exciting uh let's see what else we got I'm just gonna come back over here oh we got some uh oregon grape also known as mahonia this is our state flower here in oregon um this one is done blooming, it looks like. Come on. And it's starting to make some berries. I hear they're edible, I've never had them. But uh, very sour. Let's see, what else we got? I actually picked the spot because I thought it was... Oh, here's a good thing. Okay, here is a red osier dogwood. Come on, there we go. Very cute little cluster of flowers here. And these just started blooming. It's not like the other dogwoods we have around here. Uh, let's see, what is this? This looks like a, possibly a hazelnut tree. It's, uh, well, can we see any? I don't see any indications of nuts, but hey. Let's see, what else we got? Oh, we've got um, piggyback plant. And it makes these little cups that looks like they're going to seed already. Come on, there we go. So that's pretty neat. Um, these little spikes kind of come off sometime and end up wherever and it's like, what the heck is that? Anyway, piggyback plant. It's native. Uh, wow. Okay. Here's some wild rose just hanging out here. More piggyback plant. Let's see. What else? Oh, I saw somebody coming down the path. I must have spooked them. Um, let's see birds chirping. I don't know what this is. This just started blooming the other day. I'll have to look that one up. It's really cute. It kind of looks like a blackberry, but the spikes are not scary and the leaves are fuzzy. I don't know. Looks like, it does look like some kind of wild berry. Let's see what else we got here. Oh, there was that guy. Okay, let's see. What else we got? I saw some thimble berries around here, too. They just started blooming. Let's take a look. Oh, they're going to be right around this bend, I think. Okay. Oh, I just saw some mint. There's the river. This is Tualatin River. Very nice. Oh, here we go. All right, thimbleberry. These just started blooming. They got these really beautiful, sort of papery looking flowers. And these leaves are really, really fuzzy. When I was in like outdoor studies or what, I didn't have outdoor school, but they said that this is referred to as nature's toilet paper. Um, and the berries are delicious if you could find them. It's usually the birds get to them first. Here's a vine maple. This is native. These grow all over the place. Got a nice canopy on it. It's looking beautiful. Let's see here. I don't know what this is. This looks like bleeding heart, but it's it's not. I don't know what it is. It's fuzzy, so it can't, it's not. But I've been seeing it. It might be a buttercup of some type. I'm not sure. I thought I saw some blooming elsewhere. Um, Got some red clover. Uh, don't remember what that's called. That's a weed. Here's some mint that grows wild all over the place. It's looking really cute. More Mahonia. Get a shot of those glossy leaves. So not all the plants on this trail obviously are native, but oh, here's a currant that's still trying to flower. Ooh, it's making berries. And it has a spider web on it. Anyway, I love currants. I think I'm going to get a current tattoo. 
I just, they bloom right around my birthday. And this is really cool. Yum. Well, the birds will enjoy those. Well, let's see, what else we got? That's about it. I mean, that's a ton of stuff. That's a ton of different plants. I'll we'll have to go back and see what I showed you. But yeah, this is what I get to see every day on my walk. It's great, I love it here. This is a cool town, even if it does have a new seasons next to a Cabela's, which is super weird, but what are you gonna do? All right, that's all I got for you today. I'll talk to you later, bye.